Shut up and sit down. Hey, hello. I am the Cyber Earth Guru. Welcome to the channel. Thank you for watching. Uh, it is uh, ridiculously cold here on the East Coast, and I am wearing my hat. Uh, and so I just wanted to say shout out to anyone who is in also equally cold weather where uh, we had some uh, 70 degree temperature drop in the last uh, 48 hours and we're expecting maybe some snow on Tuesday which is cool because we have really received any snow all winter which is very disappointing for me and my snowblower but nevertheless I'm quite okay with that so hey Everyone, uh, so so uh, the, the spinners are becoming very popular, and so Inventables has actually done a uh, contest recently. Uh, I think it started yesterday or the day before on making spinners, and so their goal is really to uh, how do you make a 3D? I'm sorry, a, a CNC uh, cut uh, spinner, and so I entered the contest. Uh, I just uh, farted around pretty much most of today. Uh, doing some uh, spinner and so I, I came up with this guy here hopefully you can see it uh, this is uh, some HDPE uh, with some I'll get that to kind of focus focus it's better when I do it manual uh, HDPE uh, two color uh, um, spinner so this this is in contrast to the uh, spinner that I made uh, that was 3D printed. So this is interesting because I got I got to be honest with you, these bearings they went in uh, super nice. Uh, they're a little a little loose, um, which is not what I was expecting to be quite honest with you. But um, I did this design. I, I pulled some images off of uh, off of Google and made the design. Hey, oh, the dog's here. Roxy, come on. Come up. Hi. Is that? She's the boxer. Uh -huh. Thank you so much. All right, put the belly down. She's super cute and a super pain in the you know what. All right, so. Hey, so I pulled an image off of uh, Google. I uh, transposed it on top of the image, uh, on top of the uh, the design that I was making, and then I just put the holes in for the for the um, the bearings here. I actually uh, I'm thinking about using uh, hex nuts instead of these uh, these uh, bearings uh, <laughs> if for no other reason. They're just less expensive, and they they probably weigh as much, if not more. So uh, this guy works pretty well. Um, I posted this out on the Inventables website. I just want to do a quick uh, kind of shout out to Inventables. I think they're awesome, and I think what Zach's doing is amazing. Um, so uh, maybe they'll be good enough to uh, give me a shout out as well. But uh, so hey, um, you can make uh, these spinners from more than just 3D printing. So just remember that. And um, if you don't have a uh, CNC machine, I'll be honest with you, they are probably a uh, pretty good investment. Uh, you can get uh, the uh, X car for about the same as a mid-range, low-range 3D printer. Uh, and um, Carby's a little bit more expensive, but uh, that's the way to go. I started out in CNC uh, for lots of reasons, uh, and then I've moved on from there. So, hey, if you like this video, please... Give it a thumbs up. If you don't like it, as always, please give it a thumbs up. Remember, it's cold outside. It's right now about 18 degrees. And um, thanks for watching. Have a great night.